Okay, so today, today we answer the two day old question. Will this hideous metal clip put the fish off when compared to a standard Palomar? Let the games begin. 20 alternating casts, see if a pattern emerges. All right, that's the last little one I'll show. Um, but now it's just tit for tat. They don't seem to care about the metal. Um, they're hitting that, they're actually more of come on the little metal jig, but that's another one for the Palomar. Um, but so far, that, that little metal contraption doesn't seem to put them off. And if I stop the test right now, it's actually caught more fish. Um, but that means nothing. I don't think the little metal thing hurts at all. So I'll keep using it. Okay, so they're still whacking away. They're, they're hitting much more freely now. I think I've worked out the retrieve. Uh, they're all still peewees, but this might give me a chance to see which has the better hookup ratio. So far, I'm suspecting the Palomar might. Um, early days, obviously, but, and I, also the wire contraption, they pick up the same amount of weed, but it's much easier to clear with a Palomar. Uh, so, we'll see how we go. There's big, there's much bigger. These, these are half the size of what's in here. Um, so we'll see how the day progresses. Okay, so you gotta take everything I say with a big bag of salt. The, uh, I've only been using those little metal clips for about an hour. Um, and they don't hurt catch rates. I do, there's couple, two negatives. One, I think that the Palomar does give a slightly better hookup ratio because I'll have retrieves with that metal clip where I'll get hit seven times and don't hook up and then cast straight back out with a Palomar and have two hits and then hook up. Um, so I've been using it for an hour. It doesn't mean anything, but that's my hunch in these very early stages. Um, those metal clips, one negative is when you get weight, they both, both rigs collect the same amount of weed, but it's easier to clear from a Palomar knot, uh, than it is that, you know, that twisted wire. So half time, I'll give it a rest, give myself a rest as well. That wind is nasty today. Um, yeah, so I'll have a flick around in another pond, come back and see if anything changes. All right, time for the second half. I'm also going to change both setups from this brown guy to a little white paddle tail and see what happens. Well, the second half looks like it's gonna go just like the first so far. But all still hitting the lure. Little white paddle tail, that's the Palomar doing the business. Um, but the wire's still working as well. So I don't think I'll get much filming done unless I get a good one. All right, second half went the same as the first. My None of my impressions have changed. Um, Basically, those little wire twisty things with the hook sticking off that I made up, you'd need a reason to use them. Uh, the Palomar has a marginally better hookup rate. Um, and this is, take everything I'm saying with a bag of salt because I only use it for an hour. Um, but yeah, slight, I think it's got a slightly better hookup rate. Not enough to stop me using those metal clips, but you'd need a reason to use those metal clips. And the only reason I'd have is if I was fishing new water or snaggy water, where I was losing a lot of leads um, and I didn't want the end of my trace to get too short. Um, so yeah, summary, you need a reason to use them. And if you don't, just use Palomars in my opinion anyway. And that's based on an hour and a half of chucking them. <laughs> okay.